Yo guys, Insane Gamer 52 here, and today I'm going to show you the location for all 25 of the Lost Soul chests in the new Coiled Captors DLC. Alright, so Lost Souls are the new currency that was added with this DLC, and you can spend them on Vesper's Wheel of Fate for some bonus rewards. The main way you earn them is by killing enemies and getting one drop per kill. Oddly enough, those drops in solo are worth two souls each, but in co-op they're only worth one. Another way you can get some quick Lost Souls is by finding these chests around the map. You are always guaranteed to get two of these chests to spawn in every area of the DLC. As a nice bonus, one of the random challenges you can get in a run is to find both chests in every area. There are 5 areas in total, and each area has 5 possible spawns for a total of 25 locations. Alright, so on the first map, the first chest location is off to the right side of the starting area behind this snow hill. The second location is on the left side of the starting area on top of these small cliffs. The third location is after you open the door with the rotating dials just to the left as you go down the stairs. The fourth location is to the right of this pond area tucked back in this recess in the wall. And the fifth location is on a platform in the middle of the pond. This location is always guaranteed to be on the map so you will only get one of the other locations. You have to unlock this location by interacting with this skull on a chain right next to the pond. On the second map, the first location is in this merchant stall right in front of where you spawn. The second location is to the right of the first set of dials that you have to rotate up on this platform. The third location is next to the second set of dials you have to rotate on top of this ledge. The fourth location is in the back left side of the map in the corner of this little side room. And the fifth location is in the middle of the map underneath the central room where the final set of dials is. On the third map, the first chest location is to the right of this upper area behind one of the wheels that you have to turn. The second location is to the left side of this upper area behind the other wheel you have to turn. The third location is just past that on the side path on the far left side of the map. The fourth location is in the large room just past that on the lower part of the map. And the fifth location is on the back right side of the lower area just to the left of the portal to the next map. On the fourth map, the first chest location is just to your left after you jump down the waterfall. The second location is up on top of the roof of this building on the right side of the map. The third location is in the cave behind that building. The fourth location is in the middle of the map up on this corner of the water channel. And the fifth location is on the back left side of the map behind this giant rock pile. On the fifth map, the first chest location is to the right of where you land when you use the air jump right next to spawn. The second location is on the same platform just to the left of that. The third location is on the left side of the map down the stairs on the back left of that platform. The fourth location is in the back center of the map right behind where the portal spawns. And the fifth and final location is in the back right side of the map behind the set of dials that you have to rotate. If you found any part of this guide helpful, let me know by dropping a thumbs up. And feel free to subscribe for more in-depth guides in the future. Alright, that's all I got. I'll see you guys next time.